since the release of its first season back in 2014, it didn't take long for Outlander to become the biggest romantic drama in the history of the Stars Network. And with a troupe of fantastic cast members coupled with time travel, this was really no surprise. But how friendly are the cast with one another? And what are some of the best bloopers from the set of the show? For all this and more, stay tuned. First of all, let's talk about the moment Katriana used Bill's first name. This really celebrates the relationships the cast members have with one another on set. For those of you who don't know, it takes ages to film an entire season of a franchise, especially when considering something as big as Outland, which usually films during the winter, and as such, is often delayed by poor weather. This leaves more than enough time for the cast to become familiar with one another, and if reports are to be believed, five seasons of the show have led to some pretty intense friendships behind the curtains. The only problem with this is that it becomes a lot more difficult to distinguish between a cast member and his character, something that Katriana Balfe battled with in the earlier stages of production. This leads us to the first blooper on our list, which features the leading lady addressing Bill Patterson by his first name during the filming of season one. Since Bill portrays a character by the name of Ned Gowan, he is clearly surprised to hear Katriana address him in this manner, and simply stared at her in disbelief for a few brief seconds. Confusion then quickly turned to humor as the pair burst out into laughter. What's even funnier about this blooper is that Katriana's character, Claire Frazier, was actually calling Ned in a moment of panic. So while the cast and crew were expecting a serious moment with intense acting, they were instead treated to an innocent but comical mistake. And then we have Sam Hewen, who hilariously denied needing help in a vital scene. For those of you who don't know, Sam Hewen is the man behind the character of Jamie Frazier, and he's somewhat important considering how the relationship between Jamie and Claire is the number one reason why Outlander fans tune in to every new installment of the show. Suffice to say, the showrunners needed a massive amount of chemistry between these two characters. But luckily for Sam and Katriana, this wasn't hard at all to achieve. From their first script reading together, they clicked and showed the original author of the novels that she was wrong for wanting someone other than Sam to play Jamie. And as the series went on, the chemistry only grew. In fact, some fans even suggested that Sam and Katriana had taken their romance off screen from how adorable they were together during a variety of interviews. That being said, this was never confirmed. Probably one of the greatest fan service moments in the first season was the first time Jamie and Claire slept together, though. And according to season one outtakes, this moment was actually preceded by a hilarious conversation between Sam and the crew. While the two actors are standing close to one another on set while filming, Katriana caresses Sam's chest, which leads to the director to shout, breast, as an instruction to Sam. Without skipping a beat, though, he responds with, I got it, don't you worry, which causes Katriana to snicker. As it turns out, nobody needed to instruct him further. That's not all, though, as Sam also got a bit too rough with a prop knife once. This happened during the filming of season two, which saw Jamie and Claire traveling to France together with the intent of stopping the Jacobite rising of 1745. Unfortunately for them, nothing could sway Prince Charlie from his quest, which made the doomed conflict somewhat inevitable. But it was the trauma that Jamie was experiencing at this point that really painted the picture for the scene. You see, after being abused by Jack Randall for months on end, Jamie wasn't in the best of places. This leads to a terrifying moment where he wakes up to see Randall in his bed, which causes him to reach for a knife and use all of his strength to stab at the attacker. Another intense moment that is sharply brought to an end in the season two blooper reel, which shows Jamie going at it with a bit too much vigor behind the scenes. While we watch him launch himself into the moment, he quickly stops after a few stabs and sheepishly looks into the camera. Clearly confused as to why Sam stopped so suddenly, the director goes on to ask what's happening, which causes Sam to hold up the prop knife, which is low and limply swinging from its handle. This was to be expected though, especially after Sam had been hyped up just before the moment. And if the death of one prop knife was needed to secure that final scene, we'd say it was well worth it. Next up is a funny moment that took place between McTavish and his horse. For those of you who need a quick reminder, considering how all this took place in season two, Graham McTavish was best known for his portrayal of Dougal McKenzie in the Outlander universe, a character that had more than enough tense moments with Jamie leading up to the final battle of the season. And since high stake battles are considered to be some of the most serious portions of the show, you can imagine just how tense things were behind the scenes that day. But as said by comedian W.C. Fields a few decades ago, you should never work with children or animals, as both are incredibly unpredictable. So unpredictable, in fact, that one simple moment could result in a tense standoff being ruined. Take a look at the season two blooper reel and you'll see what we mean. Just before the battle between the Highlanders and the British, Dougal strikes up some tension and has a rather intense conversation with Jamie about falling under his command. To see whether Dougal is loyal, he sends the man off to inspect the marsh and report back on whether it would be a good battleground. But this results in Dougal being shot at by the British, who actually winds up getting a bullet straight through his hat. When McTavish jumps up from the horse to inspect his hat though, his equine co-star decides to relieve himself in full view of the camera. In a true 
true show of brilliance, McTavish pushes on though. Oh, and we can't forget about that time Catriona was almost ravished by a snake. This took place during the filming of season 3 of Outlander, where Catriona's character found herself aboard the porpoise under the control of Captain Leonard. Since a case of typhoid had begun to ravage the ship, Claire was brought on as the only healer that could really help the sailors make it through the journey. But as it turns out, we come to know that the captain actually knows about the warrant for Jamie's arrest, and also has brought Claire aboard to use her as collateral if things go sour. Suffice to say, Claire jumps overboard so that she can somehow warn Jamie, only to have the sea beat her down and wash her up on a seemingly deserted island. This leads to a rather intense scene, where Claire awakes with a large snake slithering across her. In the final scene, we see her holding her breath for ages, until the snake finally redirects itself and slithers away. But in a blooper, we come to discover that the snake was actually a lot more friendly than anyone expected it to be. While filming, the snake ventured somewhere that only Jamie should have gone, which resulted in Catriona responding with a sharp squeal and giggle. She quickly informed the worried crew that she wasn't in any danger though, and went on to say the snake had unfortunately just slithered up her skirt. That wasn't the only time Catriona's skirt featured in the blooper reel though. One of the most hilarious bloopers took place during the filming of Heaven and Earth, which took place during season 3 of the show. After having just saved the crew of the porpoise from their tough battle against typhoid fever, we see Claire walking among them and being thanked by shouts and glasses being waved in the air. For once, she was the heroic one, which clearly had her in great spirits. The blooper version of this scene was a lot more difficult though. Before even reaching the crew quarters, Catriona's skirt was caught by a gust of wind, which made it balloon up and resemble a sail. Clearly embarrassed by the moment, Catriona quickly pushed her skirt down and continued on with the scene in the hopes that nobody had noticed. But the background singing had already died down, with the actors instead choosing to fill up the studio with laughter. A moment that's made even funnier by Catriona asking, what happened? And there you have it, some of the most hilarious Outlander bloopers you'll see. What do you think of the good times the cast have behind the scenes though? And what are your expectations for season 6? Be sure to let us know in the comments section down below.